Hey everybody, so today I want to show you a fun little function that BMW DMEs have that measures and evaluates the quality of the fuel that you're putting in. So if you live in a state with notoriously poor fuel, like I do, where 91 is the highest we get, um, using this function can help you know, determine uh, which fuel stations or fuel brands uh, are giving you slightly better quality than others. So to look at this, we need to use ISTA, which you can see I have loaded here, and I'm in the main screen that appears after you finish uh, connecting to the vehicle. So to find this fuel quality function, we'll go ahead and go to uh, vehicle management, and then we'll go to service functions. And once this loads, then we're going to go to this uh, powertrain uh, uh, area over here. Then we'll go to the engine electronics, and uh, this is uh, for my BMW M2 competition, so this is an S55 engine in DME. Uh, then the next place we'll go to is where it says fuel grade, and says display fuel grade. Then we'll go over to the right to the ABL, and we'll double click that. And so here on the right side under you know the specification data, this will tell you kind of how this procedure works. Um, so if I read it, it says, you know, the fuel grade service function only determines the knock resistance of the refueled petrol. To do so, the signals from the knock sensors are measured during acceleration. The fuel grade knock resistance is calculated in the engine control unit or DME based on this information. So, uh, you know, if you have a high level of knock resistance, then this is considered a high fuel grade. And if you have a low level of knock resistance, then it's a low fuel grade. So that's kind of, you know, going with what octane does, right? So anyhow, over on the left, this is where we can tell it, okay, uh, you know, you have a couple uh, selections to read out the data. So the top one is read out the overall statistics of all tank fills. So let's go ahead and just take a look at that. Wait a little bit while the uh, data comes up. And then, if we zoom in a little so you can uh, see a bit better, it says the number of tank fills with a low quality range I've had is 12, which is no surprise since, you know, 91 is the standard here. Uh, the number of tank fills with medium fuel grade, right, is 5, and the number of tank fills with a high quality fuel has been 1. So after we've, you know, looked at that, then we can go hit continue and it'll take us back to that main page. And the next two uh, uh, selections we have on the left are, we can read out the individual statistics uh, of the last five tank fills, or we can just, you know, end this service function. So let's go ahead and see the last five fills. So you can see here, right, a, uh, a, a value of zero means it's uh, invalid. Value of one means it's low. Value of two means medium grade, and three is high grade. So, looking at uh, the uh, tank uh, of uh, the last, oh, sorry, this is showing you the last five tanks, right? So, the tank one, two, three, four, five. Um, anyhow, the last time I filled this up, it says my fuel grade was two, which makes sense because the last tank I had of this was uh, when I was at Sonoma Raceway and I used the uh, race gas pump there to uh, do a mixture uh, uh, of, of fuels and get roughly a 93 octane equivalent. Um, and then before that it says the fuel grade was two, which also makes sense because that was another racetrack fill where I was getting a uh, 93 octane equivalent fill. Uh, then it says tank, my third tank before that was fuel grade three, so the highest. And that also makes sense because that's when I was at Thunder Hill and I was filling up with uh, 100 octane and 91 to mix, uh, to give myself a 95 octane uh, uh, grade overall. And then uh, before that it said fuel grade was two, which once again makes sense because I was at the track and uh, I was giving myself a, a 93 octane um, at that point. And then this one says zero because well, you know, when, when I was mixing at the two stations, uh, the fill was so close together. If we look over on the right side of the window and then we uh, scroll down a little bit, you can see how the grading is done under this section called fuels. And uh, you know, it shows you this, uh, 90, this uh, 91 section here, right? This is the low grade and then you see the separator bar. 
and shows you this 95 saying premium grade and then this 98 showing uh, the high grade uh, and it also has some other you know um, characteristics of the fuel so just like before when you're done looking at your fuel grades uh, you can just go ahead and hit continue and then you know end the service function to uh, get out of this so anyways that's the fun little function they have in there if you've ever wondered you know which brand is better for your vehicle or another with respect to knock resistance well you know the BMW uh, DME will tell you uh, if you have Vista.